In this video, we're going to talk about inflation. Now, inflation and appreciation actually have a relationship between them. That relationship is that they're both about things becoming more expensive, and they're both calculated using the compound interest formula. Now, a really good example of inflation is something we hear our grandparents talk about all the time, and they talk about how much things were. For example, they might say something such as, in my day, a bottle of Coke was only 10 cents. Now when you go to the shop, that bottle of Coke might be $3. So why is that? Well, inflation is talking about how everything becomes more expensive each year. These things are goods and services. So some examples of this are a person's wage or a can of soft drink, a hamburger, other things that you go and buy at the shop. So let's look at the two examples below. We have a soda drink, let's say it used to be 10 cents, and a hamburger, let's say the hamburger was 20 cents. Now the drink might be $3 and the hamburger might be $5, let's say. So it's become a lot more expensive over time. Should we be concerned with these price increases? Well, not really, because even though they've become more expensive, our wage has increased also. Back when a hamburger and a drink were really cheap, people might have only made, I don't know, $20 a week. Whereas now, when they've become more expensive, we might be making $800 a week. So it all balances out at the end. Now, the rate of inflation is usually about 2 to 3 percent every year. So every year everything come, becomes about 2 to 3 percent more expensive. Anyway, that concludes our video introducing inflation. Remember to read the description below for links to work booklets that relate to this video.